guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to going to episode 6 and 7 of season 2 of The Dangers in My Heart. Yeah. Yeah, The Dangers in My Heart. I'm hot. <laughs> but other than that, it's got to get started with episode 6 and 3, 2, 1, go. Also, yes, you see, like, it, it's not really, well, braiding wise, we're done, we're done, yes, but curling, I still have to get it curled, hot press, yeah, so we're doing that tomorrow. I got that. Okay. I can work at that. No, no, you're just. <laughs> Literally, guys, do not use art. Right, like, when you're trying to make a video, and it, well, girls, don't put on lip gloss when you're trying to do a video. Later next thing you know, you're going to smudge away your teeth. Um, also one more thing, BTW, it is 6.33, um, this little bad boy is about to go off very soon, so just in case you hear a woman also talking in the background, it's just about the weather. But you're here. Yeah, I didn't think about that, right? <laughs> oh. baby <laughs> come on yeah let her help you you have to get comfortable being around more than like five people babe See? You can do it.
Stop. I can't. They so fucking cute. Fucking idiots. Yeah, he likes someone else. But see, at the same time, I really wish, bro, like dead ass, read the fucking room, read the room. She does not, she's not interested. Yamada is technically taken. Oh, really? I think we're all secretly like that. Yeah. Uh -uh. Aren't you putting a little too much on him? I mean, like, damn. Right. I mean, I love doing everything online. That's just me. But there are pros and cons, you know. There you go. Flash that thing. <laughs> oh my god, my thing is stuck on my. Well, I mean, it still looks good. <laughs> Excuse me. So it doesn't go off. Ah. <laughs> yeah. I love it though. It's cute. Yamada? Right, but once again, that just tells you how much he's grown. That's like the really good thing. I mean, I don't consider you guys troublemakers. Hmm. You okay with that? Mm 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. See, no, that's when I, instead of calling FaceTime, video call, and be like, this is where it is, get your ass over here. Oh no. Okay, do you know the fastest way? Thank you! I did not mean to move down like that. I'm sorry. <laughs> again. Listen to Jim Fukuyama. You did. So you are stronger than you realize it. Please, we have to! I don't know, sir. Do you know who you are? Like,
Mm-hmm. Say that shit again. Say it again. You did my, oh my god, baby! Oh no. Of course. No. Go on. We need luck. Come talk to him later. <laughs> See, he's just the. Oh, shit! Uh, once again, he's just the cutest little protective boyfriend even if they're not in a relationship. I love that. Okay. But the question is, is she really going to... There you go. Let him down gently. We gotta do that. Right. I'm gonna like you.
<laughs> no, it's just the confirmation that she likes him. And now it's just, oh my god, he actually likes me, Jesus Christ. We're like, oh fuck, what the fuck am I supposed to do? I don't know how to feel. Like, dead ass. I mean, I think we all feel like that. Especially with, like, a significant other, just anyone and such. But no! Oh my god. Okay, he did good at his speech. I, I was definitely nervous for him because you just never know what the fuck is gonna happen. And, like, one wrong thing is you, you have a big fuck up and everyone just reminds you and remembers you. Oh, hey, remember when you did that fuck up? Fuck you. <laughs> oh, my God. F -f 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 fuck you. Like, you don't want to remember for all that. Thank God, like, um, people who I am still friends with high school, like, do I remember some of the stupid things I did in middle school and high school? Yeah, I, I did some dumb, dumb shit and such, but do I let that define me? No. I surely don't. I am. I'm, I'm still the same girl that I was in high, from high school and middle school, except I'm a lot more mature and such. And so, yeah, I, I definitely think, you know, for our lovely little boy, this definitely, you know, evolved. And he's even a lot more mature than he once was at the beginning of this. It, it's so funny because, once again, he even said it like six months ago. He would not have these girls be touching on his hair all like that and such. And so, once again... That just tells you how much this boy has evolved from episode one up until now. And I really love that for him. He's doing well. Now that the fact is, you know, the elephant is now out of the bag, it just makes you wonder going into episode seven now, or episode 19, um, specifically, like, any little thing that they do, is it going to make it a little more awkward now that, you know, they know, yeah, 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 yeah. Because I don't know, is they going to like him and such. But what I am hoping for, because since we are very, very close to the end of this, number one, as I've said, I, I mean, okay, I'll change my mind on some things. I, I'm okay if we don't see a kiss once again. I am definitely okay if we do not see a kiss. I'm, I'm like, kind of really, that is like, I'm, I'm good. We can move on from that. We can end this show without a kiss. Not every, in my opinion as of now, not every romance show has to have a kiss at the end. I would love to see it signified, you know, end with a little cute little fucking kiss. But no, if it ends with these two just dating and such, I'm okay with that too. Just give me, like, the cutest little lovey-dovey confession and just make me cry. Because you know it's going to fucking happen. I'm going to cry like a little bitch. <laughs> such by the end of this. We've already had that happen with uh, the marriage, my happy marriage. And that, <laughs> that took me. But yeah, I got a pause video and I will see you guys in one second for episode seven. Alrighty, episode seven in three, two, one, go. <laughs> he really, really recorded it. <laughs> no, but it was good, babe. Kotaro, you did good. Right? That's kind of hot. <laughs> oh, no. She was there. Yes, duh. Come on now. The way y'all look at each other, the way that y'all just obviously look the other way, the way.
course. Duh. What'd you think was gonna fucking happen? It's already too late. <laughs> Being creepy. <laughs> well, yeah. Uh, psh, this is Yamada we're talking about. It's still eaten. You okay? You want to talk about it? <laughs> well, yeah, but, you know... I mean, well, yeah, Yamana, I get that, but technically you're still part of the team. Answering that truthfully, bro. <laughs> yes, no. No, baby. Sweet. You are so fucking sweet. <laughs> Imagine he sings the whole opening. <laughs> It'd be like season one of um, Misfit of Demon King Academy when the previous sale for Anos sang, you know, his opening. Dad. <laughs> I'm sorry. Being a girl right now. <laughs> Oh. 
You know, no, 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 let me change it. Comfy! <laughs> Are we establishing dominance right here? I mean... She was just like, look at Dave. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. No. So what do you really call yourself? Just hanging out? <laughs> huh? Make it a boy girl. <laughs> Ooh, that one feels weird. <gasps> you look so cute, baby. Aww. One day, Deja, one day we're going to go there and I'm going to take lots of pictures and I'm like, yeah! <laughs> Literally, you know, we hope that one day that I can also meet some of my subs and be like, hi! Be like, konnichiwa! I'm about to say it wrong, but I ain't going to say it! <laughs> Yes. But I mean, he enjoyed it. Baby was. <laughs> no.
why don't you get something that she would like? I mean, okay, my thing is, all right, Yamada also likes food, okay? So get her a pair of earrings that's food themed. Like, I, I've fallen in love with, like, these strawberry cake ones. Anything that's like that. Because your girl also loves the shit out of strawberries. <laughs> There's Yamada. Yeah! <laughs> well, Avi. What? What did you? <laughs> God, it's not like that. We were just trying to figure out right. <gasps> Was that cheesecake? Well, you know, just say she's not my type. Uh, like Yamada. Right? Oh, just stop. Are you sure, babe? He's basically saying it's okay for her to have as much as she wants. Oh my god! <laughs> That's a green flag! <sighs> I'm gonna cry. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Oh my god. Damn show, oh my god. Like, no, because I have a crush on her. Damn it. Yes. It's not hilarious. 
don't say that. You are cut out for her. I, I literally hate when guys say that. Like, seriously, do not say that. You can get any girl or any guy that you want. You just have to be yourself. Seriously. Excuse me? What's wrong? Uh oh. The read the room. Found ya. Sure, 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 sure. You have to, baby. You really do. It's not good to really compare yourself to others. You're never going to be like them. And here comes my husband to save the fucking day. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's you. No, it, it's sweet. <laughs> so, of course, it's even more important. And you made it. Nope, we're going to eat it. Wait, don't go. Hold on. Wait.
put it on me. You got it. There you go. So pretty. Because it's kind of technically signifying you two as a fucking couple! No, the fact that he, like, I, I love the fact that the double date in a nutshell was cute. Literally to try to give someone, you know, a pep in their step and, you know, trying to put some fire in their butt and be like, you gotta lift that shit off. Like, oh my God, like, let's go. Let's fucking go. And such. I'm happy that the idea was, you know, to fruition and such. I love the fact that even for our other couple who is not really getting as much screen time as these do, they're still getting something. I also love that the fact is with him and the fact is like, okay, she's this cute little curvy girl. I mean, Yamada is too. They're both curvy in like two different ways and such. There is like, um, like me, I, I have curves ish. Do not look at my boobs. <laughs> As I said, you know, I, I feel like I have that hourglass shape of a body, but at the same time, like, the biggest thing that I fucking hate is my stomach and such. I cannot lose anything in my fucking stomach, no matter how the fuck I try. Um, but literally, I love the fact that in that moment, she, she comes in with just this cute little tart, and she's like, I'm gonna eat this because I'm already full. I already ate as much. I'm okay with just having this. And he literally is like, no, like, I am paying. You can have as much as you would like. Like, literally, to get me to fucking cry at that shit. Like, oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? I, I literally cannot. It, it was just so freaking sweet and wholesome. It's just like, I, I can't. I fucking cannot with this damn show once again. Literally, just in that moment, and literally, a guy, just having a guy saying like, "Hey, if you want sweets, like you, you earn this. You did good. I don't care." It, the fact is, he also said like he didn't care if she was fat or skinny. That's a green flag right there. That's such a green flag. Like, we love that. We love the green flag, yes! Oh my god, we just had to show the, the green bottle. <laughs> but, I, I mean, because it just makes you wonder when you look at, like, all these other anime characters that you, like, clearly have crushes on, guys, girls, whatever, you, you know, it makes you wonder. I'm like, if I look like this, do you think they're going to take me seriously? You think they're going to ask me out? Yes, yes, you wonder. Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe one day we'll also talk about that. Um, But no, I thought that was very sweet. Even with the fact that, like, you know, yeah, Yamada comes in at the wrong possible freaking moment, and and she got always like, oh, no, that's cute. And you're like, oh, here comes jealous Yamada and such. You're like, oh, oh, you feel that? You feel that chill, the essence in the air? Girl. <laughs> Bruh, shit's fucking hilarious. Um, Once again, she giving out them dagger eyes, and I, I'm, I'm here for it, and I fucking love it. Like, bitch, yes, because same. I, I would literally, like, when people fuck me over, <laughs> when people fuck me over, <laughs> they, they sometimes know, not all the time, sometimes you have to give them that quote-unquote hint that they fucked you over or they fucked me over, but yeah, yeah, other than that, it's all good, it's Gucci in my world right now, bitch, but no, this was really sweet, like, dead ass. It's, even with the fact that he got her the bracelet and he put it in the muffin. And the fact that they had the dog bone to match the keychains. Goodbye. I am deceased. I am dead. Okay? I, I'm gone. Like, 
I am dead. I am no longer here anymore. Because this is too fucking much. This fucking show. Like, boom. Gag me with a spoon. I, I literally cannot with these couple anymore. And such. But I do also love the fact is that, you know, Ishikawa was very much like, oh my god, I'm, I'm like, she's way out of my league. I, like, literally... Um, no, like, I can't work up to her. I Like, look at her and look at me. I'm average. She's, like, fucking superior. Okay. To my guys, I am going to say this, because girls, you know, you know, because, duh. Guys, please, 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 for the love of everything that is holy, do not compare yourself or size yourself up to any other guy or even girl depending on how, you know, whoever the person you're going with, um, has dated in their past life. This isn't freaking Scott Pilgrim versus the world in, you know, Seven Evil Exes and shit like that. No matter what, like, how the, the previous person in the relationship looks, remember, you're a brand new person coming in with her or him. Do not ever bring your baggage from your previous relationship into your new relationship. Always, like, start it out on a good foot. Always communication is key, but just never really compare yourself to any other guy, including the guys he or she has previously dated and or being like getting stuck in your head and being like, oh my God, I'm literally like no match for her. I, I like, I literally hate when guys do that. And us girls, we do that too. We really do. Like, you know, it's like, God damn, he's like everything and I'm just absolute shit. <laughs> but no, like seriously, always look at yourself as a... Okay, I'll say this. So, you know, I'm like, when people like to freaking rate themselves and such, and the next thing you know, someone else rates themselves, rates them, and it's like that. Um, I always say, I look at myself as a 10 or a fucking 11. Like, I am the baddest person that you're ever going to see. I am also the shyest person that you'll ever meet. I'm very, once again, quiet to myself. But, you know, once you get to know me, <laughs> you get to see a different side of me. But, um, I'm always going to be 100% honest regardless and tell you like whatever you're doing right and whatever you're doing wrong in the relationship and it's just like once again communication is key and you take it slow there there's no reason to make it fast unless you want it fast but take it slow take your time go on a double date you know go go to go on a fucking coffee date go get some coffee go get some um uh what is something i like to eat right now go eat some um Korean barbecue or like go eat some really good seafood yeah go go eat go talk about shit and whatever and then you know woo them not on the first date please like fourth date but be good protection everything that's all i need to say but other than that guys that is our reaction read towards episode seven and eight of season two of the dangers in my heart if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join the mattress squad and of course i will see you guys officially all next saturday for patreons and next thursday yes Thursday. Next Thursday for everybody else, but until then, I will see you guys all next time. Hopefully, when this comes up, because when I upload this at the same time, I literally have to check because some weird thing happened in the previous video. The video was longer than it was supposed to be. I don't know why, like, an extra, like, how many ever minutes had just a black ass screen for some weird reason and I didn't add it. So my editing thing fucked up. I don't know what the fuck happened, but it fucked up. So praying that does not happen. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.